Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Slescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, tonight we are in Barbagallo in Australia and we're going to race this exciting track. So let's go down and have a look at how I built it. So here's a picture of our track as it comes out of the book. Now I had to shorten it a little bit on that curve that's right there because I ran out of tables. So here we are at the start-finish gate. And we've got our start-finish gate here. There's a track and a track for the controllers. And the crack of the table is in between here, just as a reference point. So we've got one, two, three, four, five straights. And then we have our 1-60 uh, with a 1-30, a 2-30, three of them. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven straights. And I went to a bit of a switch here. So we got a two 30s, three of them for a 90 degree turn with a one 60 and a one 30, two 30. Then we've got the two 30s here and a three 30 to gentle out the curve as it shows on the drawing. There's three of those. A straight with a cross, and then we have a 3 30 and a 2 30 and a 2 dash, or 3 30 and a 2 30. And then we've got our 2 30s 1, 2, 3, 4, and or sorry, 3 30s and 2 30s. Two straights, I got my switch and the chicane there. 3 30 and a 2 30. Then a 1, 2, and a quarter and another straight so three and a quarter and then a 90 degree using the 2-30s and 1-60 1-30 a straight a straight and then we've got a a bit of a trick here 2-30 and a 1-30 then a 3-30 2-30 3-30 2-30 and a 1 2 and then our start finish gate so what I did was, I had to truncate this a little bit and just square it up because this curve would be out here somewhere by the time it came around and back. And I just don't have a table for that. So <laughs> there is our track, apologies for the truncation. And now we will go to actually see this track in action. So here we are at the beginning of the race, ready to go. We have seven people tonight, so I can actually film this thing properly. Ooh. And here we go. <laughs> <laughs> you got somebody. <laughs> okay. It's a pretty fast track already. Drive my drive. 
Stain on the front of the lens. <laughs> Manual focus at the same time. Car's coming into the curve. Oh, 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 that won't go. Uh-oh. Did oh, you lose the back? I'm in last. I don't care. And now Matt adjusts his rear axle. Into the pits. Oh. Come on. Use those muscles. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh. Oops. <laughs> Matt's getting piggyback right. I'm getting bullied already. Here you go. Oh, fair. Oh, 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 you take the car there, uh, right on there. I need some practice. Again. That way just reminds me of BPA. I don't know why. So I wonder how I'm going to fare. Oh, no, I need you on the track. Driver, I can't race for him again. You mean headhunt. <laughs> <laughs> the Martin Devil. Oh, and there's the clock. Ring, 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 ring. So we have <laughs> Kevin, Kevin, Mark, Devin, um, Matt, is this one? Yeah, I'm afraid. Um, who was two? Josh and Fred. So that wraps up our Can-Am race for last night. Now let's see what the overall standings were for everybody. And we go over to our whiteboard. So, last night I got 30 points. Matt got 18. He came back and raced with one of Fred's cars. Devin got 40 points. Mark got 17. Kevin got 35. Fred got 21. Alan didn't show, because apparently he was uh, at a barbecue or something campfire. And Josh got 18 points. So here are our standings. Overall I was third for 299 points. Actually let's do it from from places here. So Matt was eight at 18 points. Alan was seventh place with 90 points. Fred was sixth place with 134. Mark at 5th place with 135, Josh 4th with 230. I do think though if Josh didn't miss those three nights, he would have been 1st or 2nd. Anyway, 4th at 230, still not a bad standing. I was 3rd with 299, Kevin 2nd with 343, and our number 1 was Devin breaking 413 points. So Devin will be able to get himself a free car as an overall prize. Everybody else is getting track bucks tonight because I got those done. And our next league is street racing. It was originally going to be DTMs, but uh, I kind of ran out of finances. So I'm going to try to do DTMs for the November, December league. So we have street racing with our Porsche 918s. Our LaFerraris, the Camaro, the Pontiac Firebirds, 
And if you want to convert a digital chip, the Dodge Charger SRT8 in PETI or without are able to run, as well as Mercedes Coupe, which is a really nice car. So come and check us out in the future for our next race league starting in September. Have a good one.